kind of what I was what I was hearing when I was notating. So I think that so the tempo changes. You know, we're just gonna take that out and play it straight through. Yeah. All right, here we go. Here we go. One, two, three. Thank you, thank you. Just 93 to 107, and then we'll cut it in later. If we're ever going to sound good, <laughs> this is going to be the day and the place. We're in Capitol Studios, and the most famous studio in America, with the most famed engineer in America, with Bob Mincer, one of the great band leaders, with the best jazz students from USC, which is one of the best schools on the planet. <laughs> the treat for us in particular in being the studio is that Al Schmidt, who has 22 Grammys, more than any other engineer in history, is recording the session. Working with Bob Mincer's big band has been really amazing. Not only are they great players, but Bob has a reputation nationwide. Anyone who's into jazz kind of knows his name. What we've tried to do at USC and our Division of Contemporary Music is to have much more integration, collaboration. So there are three groups of people participating in this. You've got the Thornton Jazz Orchestra, then the screen scoring program, and production and technology. They're here to learn what they can about process. A lot of what USC offers is the community, obviously the community of students and then the community that we have built outside of the school with opportunities like today, being able to make connections in the music industry and the entertainment industry here in Los Angeles. When you leave school, you're going to be operating in these environments with these people. You really only learn by observing and talking to people who are doing it. I chose USC because it's the closest way to get into the industry and to learn from people who have worked in the industry for years and years and years.